What's poppin' ladies and gentlemen, Darkside here, man. I'm back with another video, and today we have the UFC 5 gameplay trailer. Now, I'm hoping, I'm hoping I'm wrong. I made a tweet about it earlier last week. I'm hoping I'm wrong, and this is not UFC 4.5, but everything's giving me indication that this is UFC 4.5. Let's go ahead and get into the video, man. I hope I'm wrong. I really do. I promise you I hope I'm wrong, man. I promise you I hope I'm wrong. All at once, it becomes you, and it comes at you. The graphics do look good. Graphics do look good. working to capture. And with EA Sports uh -oh. UFC 5, this is as real uh -oh. as it gets. I saw that guy. I saw that guy in another video. UFC 5 is powered by the Frostbite engine. And with the Frostbite engine... They're going real heavy on this Frostbite engine. They're going real heavy on this Frostbite engine and marketing. The Frostbite engine makes a significant impact on the quality of characters and environments. Yeah. With advanced rendering features, yep. you can deliver it's even looking more like I fighters with industry-leading facial animation technology. They're going real hard on graphics and Frostbite, not nah, hard on gameplay. Something to behold. It does come with consequences. And I can mm. tell you, mm. that, that looks nasty. nasty. The damage looks nasty. UFC Love it. All new real impact system. Okay, here we go. Talk to me. Bruising and swelling. Accumulate More visuals. locations on the body and have a realistic effect on gameplay. That oh my god. Oh my god. Authentic oh my god. Hey, my prayers were not answered. Oh my god. This is UFC 4.5. This is literally what I was saying. Oh my god. It looks almost identical to UFC 4. After three years, this is what we had to look forward to. It's crazy work by EA. Hey, this is crazy work by EA. This is crazy work. That animation is that the same animation? Nah, they're tweaking with this. They're tweaking. With this. I like this aspect. I like this. I do. But there, EA is tweaking with this. Look at the HUD. The HUD looks almost exactly the same. What's those icons or anything? Bro, this looks. Oh my God, that's the same animation. Oh no, nah, they got us. Hey, they got us. Hey, y'all did a magic trick here. Hey, they got us. Oh, that looked clean. Oh, I like that transition. Oh, I like that. That was clean. I like that. That looked clean. That looked clean. I can't cap. The seamless submission system removes the mini games. Ooh, nice. And functions oh, that's real. Ooh. Of the overall ground game. I like that. This I like that. Much faster and far more intuitive experience. All right, that's actually clean. This is actually really clean. I like this. Fluid. That's clean. That's clean. But where are the other gameplay updates, man? They look like UFC 4 with a new subsystem. Thanks to the power of Frostbite. Oh my god, thanks to the power of Frostbite. How many times are we gonna hear Frostbite? How many times? And they act like Frostbite is new. Frostbite is almost an outdated engine itself. Plus, we've added improved interactions with the referee and ground and pound Oh my god. Our worst fears were realized, boys. Our worst fears were realized. Our worst fears were realized. Hey man. Menu look kind of clear. Menu looking clear. Still similar to UFC 4 though. I like this. I like this right here though. This man. I wish that was more of an online thing though. I hope it's not just an offline thing. Okay, Connor. Look at the debut Connor. Okay. Hey man. Hey man. They got us. Valentina Shevchenko. The graphics look good. The graphics do look pretty good. This is the best training facility in the world. There is no place like it. Then there are new cinematics, locations, and a refined focus on onboarding. And last but not least, and trust me, RDA. Yeah. If you pre-order UFC 5, you'll receive a roster of legendary heavyweight fighters. Ooh, look at the great one. Look at the great one. Mike Tyson. Iron Mike. Fedor. Emilianenko. Mm. Come on, man. Looks That's good. good. Looks good. Thanks for joining us, DC. And thank you all for watching. Oh boy. We're excited for you to find out. They really got a striking tip in the trailer. <laughs> hey, was that an editing error? Oh, that's crazy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Where do I even begin with this man? Where do I even begin? I ain't gonna do the whole breakdown type thing. I'm just gonna give my thoughts real quick as I run the trailer back in the background. But this is crazy that we waited three years for this. I'm gonna say that off rip. EA is definitely tweaking. 
The striking, the first striking change I saw, it looked like I was looking at UFC 4. It was looking how I looked at UFC 4, man. This is crazy. I hope all of those people who saw the leaked gameplay earlier in the week, I hope all those people talking about it's an old build. It's not final gameplay. Is this old build too? This this not final gameplay either? They're gonna change up these animations that look exactly like UFC 4 after they release this to the public? They're gonna change that? I'm just asking, man. Hey, I'm just asking. Don't shoot the messenger. I'm just asking the real questions out here. This looks straight like UFC 4 with an update, bro. Let's be real about it. <clears throat> Let's be real about this. It's basically UFC 4.5. It's not a whole nother game. It's half a game added to UFC 4. We have to keep it a buck. EA will get away with this yet again because it's the only uh, combat sports game or uh, MMA game out there. But this is this is insane work by EA. I can't lie. The damage looks good. The visuals look good. The new subsystem looks good. The three major things they've been talking about since we've been getting news, they all look good. But we were all worried about the things they weren't talking about, like this, like gameplay, like this, like striking. Oh my god, straight like UFC 4, man is trying to block break his opponent. This is sick work by EA, I can't cap. This is actually sick work by EA. A lot of the animations look maybe slightly tuned, if not exactly the same. Um, yeah, EA did not cook with this game. They did not cook with this game. We are cooked with this game. We are cooked. Um, the Doctor Stoppages look good as well. But like I said, a lot of things like rehash, slightly updated for having this much development time and for the game to still be barely any different. I mean, look at this stand up. Those look like exact same animations in UFC 4. All of those look exactly the same. Like, I should not be saying that about your game after three years, man. Hey, I'm sorry. I know with EA, they probably won't come from my head for this, but I'm sorry. That looks like lazy development to me. Lazy development, especially with everything else we've heard about the game so far. We'll see how it plays. It looks like it plays exactly like UFC 4. I'm not going to cap to you. The ground game might be slightly different. But when I even say that, I say the ground game by the submission system. The transitions themselves look like they might be the same as well. But I guess we'll have to see and wait for that. That looked clean right there. That looked kind of... Hold on, that looked kind of snappy. Like, it was a little too fast. See how the animation on, was on that? He just snaps into place. That didn't really seem like a flow. Like, see right there? Like, boop. Yeah, I guess it's alright. It's alright. But yeah, man. I don't know about this one, EA. I'm not really too sure about this one. It's looking very UFC 4-ish. Very UFC 4-ish. EA should definitely be ashamed of themselves. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. With that being said, I'm gonna catch y'all in the next one, man. Y'all take it easy. Let me know what you guys think in the comments section down below. And I'll catch you guys in the next one, man. Peace.